Hello, my name is Jennifer Dangerfield Barber, and I'm the program coordinator for the Medical Magnet Program at Andrew Hill High School. I also teach sophomore English for the program and also medical terminology, which is a dual enrollment class, both of which are also linked medical magnet classes. At Andrew Hill and in our program, we are lucky to have a team of supportive administrators, a dedicated staff, 10 of whom are medical magnet specific program teachers, a strong counseling team that includes a, a medical magnet specific counselor, and then a, an amazing cohort of students that's over 300. Our program is centered around empowering competent, creative, open-minded, decisive, confident and curious lifelong learners to be the future leaders in their college classrooms and the healthcare workforce. There are a lot of things that I love about working for Eastside, but I've been asked to narrow it down to one, which is very difficult for me being an English teacher. But my favorite thing about Eastside is the forward thinking environment that is cultivated. For both staff and students alike, I, I love how our district embraces growth, change, and new ideas. I've seen students and staff be supported to take ideas from the classroom all the way through the Department of Education. And it truly takes a growth mindset oriented environment to make that happen. I've also personally been involved with projects that required a team effort from both staff and students and that required collaboration and support from our district leadership and our industry and college partners. My point is I've seen our students and staff at Eastside bring a lot of new, exciting and creative ideas to life and the growth mindset environment that cultivates and supports that makes Eastside somewhere that I'm really proud to work. So now I'm going to take you through a few slides that explain our program in more detail. So again, here's our mission statement, which I had mentioned uh, earlier on, but we are empowering competent, creative, open-minded, decisive, confident, and curious lifelong learners to be the future leaders in the healthcare workforce. How we do this. So our students take two to three core subject area classes and one health elective class per grade level. In those classes, they are with one of our team of 10 dedicated teachers with other medical magnet students. In the core subject areas, students complete the common core state standards and the subject area curriculum, but with a healthcare focus. As an example, our students in my English 2 class do a project where they, are, uh, they were trained in hands-only CPR, which is a type of CPR that focuses solely on the chest compressions. Uh, then they uh, used those skills to develop a presentation and a lesson plan that they taught to our uh, the middle school's eighth grade students. So they became trainers of that skill. In the health electives at each grade level, um, those are those special health electives called CTE or career technical education. Um, at the junior and senior year, they are actually dual enrollment, meaning that our junior, our, uh, junior and seniors are actually college students starting junior year and they earn credits on both the high school and the college side. So some of the benefits to having the students in these linked classes are obviously, as you can see in the picture on the right, our students get certificates of you know, achievement, um, participation. Our, our team collaborates quite a bit on how we can help students when they're struggling on developing new activities, attending professional development so that we have the most up-to-date knowledge of what to train them in for, for healthcare careers and, and more. So we also um, do a lot of professional and academic skills training. So while we are a medical magnet program, regardless of what career student ends up pursuing, many of our job and academic trainings uh, really prepare students for the skills needed for any career or college. So examples would be, as you can see on the right pictured are some of the professional certifications that we offer in our program. Uh, we also do offer internships, job shadowing, professional skills workshops, and college application workshops. We also offer as many opportunities to participate in work-based learning as possible. So this is where students gain a lot of valuable work experience, both inside and outside of the classroom. So they get to experience networking on the job training and more through activities such as hands-on projects and labs, earning professional certifications, learning healthcare specific knowledge in class, taking tours of healthcare facilities and more. We've done field trips, we've done cross-curricular projects where they do pieces of the project in each of the different subject areas that all culminates in one, uh, you know, summative assessment. 
Uh, we've, we've done a lot of different things over the years and offer a lot. Uh, we also instill a commitment to service to our students. So our students um, have a service hour requirement and they participate in community service and outreach. So for example, um, they participate in work-based learning. They do community outreach and learn to train others. They volunteer helping others in need and or learn the skills in which they can do so. So pictured on the right is um, a, a picture from our annual mass casualty incident drill where all of the students learn different ways in which first responders keep us safe and they are trained in aspects of each of those careers and then they practice it in this annual drill. We also offer leadership development. This is a major component of our program as building these leadership skills is extremely important. So our program offers opportunities to be mentored by professionals, to network, and to participate in leadership organizations such as, and again, pictured on the right, our Health Occupation Students of America, which this is a picture of our chapter at a state leadership competition. HOSA is focused around building uh, knowledge of healthcare, careers and skills, building leadership skills, and also a dedication to community service and helping others. So by enrolling in our program, students are committing to the program by prioritizing our course sequence, that is the classes offered by our program. So the core subject area classes that are our course sequence fulfill A through G graduation requirements, meaning they are still regular English history um, and science classes. And then also that students will reserve at least one elective option per year for those healthcare elective classes. Since medical magnet course sequence entails three to four uh, classes within the program each school year, students still have great flexibility to supplement their uh, schedule with other courses of interest as determined by them, you as their parent and their counselor. Additionally, being that our school also has an IB diploma program, which includes an academically rigorous course schedule with a global lens. We also offer the opportunity for our students to take advantage of the program and its opportunities. This exempts them from the junior um, and senior course sequence for medical magnet, but they are allowed to remain in the program so that they can still pursue any classes that fit outside of the IB diploma schedule. And they're still able to participate in anything that our program offers. They also have the option credits permitting to participate in, a voc in vocational medical programs offered by, um, for example, our Silicon Valley Career Technical Education Partner while still being enrolled in Medical Magnet. Overall, by the end of our program, students graduate with the skills necessary to be leaders in their college classrooms and future career environments. They will have obtained several certifications, have made connections with several professionals in different healthcare careers, and have been trained in both healthcare industry specific and soft professional skills. Students in our pathway have gone on to become doctors, pharmacists, public health professionals, nurses, medical assistants, and even business professionals. We're building our alumni network to include events where former students come back to discuss their career and college experiences so that our students not only go on to do those great things, but we also get to keep in contact so they have the opportunity to come back and speak to, about their career pathway. Uh, to, for example, your students who would be sitting in their old high school seats. So it's been a pleasure telling you about the Medical Magnet Program, and I, I hope you enjoy listening to information about all of the wonderful career pathways offered at Eastside. We look forward to working with you and your families next year. It's really hard to capture everything about our program in a single presentation, as we are constantly growing and building in terms of offerings of courses, activities, and opportunities. And you know, overall, as I said, we want our students to be critically thinking and capable adults who are able to collaborate and lead in the college and workforce environments. I encourage you to visit our, and I'm gonna show a slide uh, with this information. I encourage you to visit our district website. We have a brand new student run uh, program website. We have social media pages, and then I'm also gonna show my contact info so that you can contact me directly with any other questions you might have about our program. Okay, so finally, I'm going to show, um, this is my last slide. This, uh, go, this, this has the information for our district website, for our school student-run website, 
for our social media pages. And then again, if any questions weren't answered during my presentation or um, you don't find what you're looking for on uh, our social media or website pages, uh, please feel free to contact me directly via text message or email. Thank you very much.